Dean, a tough one to take. What are your thoughts? Um, our defender was Kamikaze, um, losing control when we're in control of possession. And the goals we gave away are, uh, are just criminal. To give away three goals in the, in the manner we did in the first 25 minutes was, was really poor. I felt their first goal was a really good counter-attack. It was actually a good goal. The second goal was rubbish and the third goal was just schoolboy. After the Maidstone game of the weekend, you said to me that something you could bring into this game today was togetherness. Do you think we lost that a little bit? No. We kept going. 3-0 you know, down, we got one back 3-1, we never lost that, our supporters got behind us, banging the drum, second half, we kept going and we caught on the break at the end, a little bit naive from young Brunties crossing from deep areas and when you cross from deep te teams can counter attack on you, I've got a rule at the football club, you have to cross on the touchline so people can counter attack, so just lost our way a little bit, our discipline in our performance, in possession, it's so important when you play against teams like Newport and that, that you don't give them opportunities to make entries and, uh, and we did that really. Um, but full credit to Newport, they've got to give them a lot, a lot of credit. Um, they were really good, to be fair, in the counter-attack, and they murdered us on it, let's be honest. But the, the tort goal's real killer, because at 2-0, the next goal's so important. And uh, the tort goal's just, you know, you wouldn't see that in the park, in, in Hackney Marshes on a Sunday. Since that third goal, though, we did have a lot of momentum. What specifically do you think we needed to do to get another goal back after? End product, final tort, end product. Oh, but you got in some good areas. I thought Nicky might have had a penalty. We were a bit lucky about our tour. It's a handball. I've seen it back. It's a clear handball by Pritch. So we had a bit, little bit of luck, but I thought it was a penalty on Nicky when it was 3 1. Um, Idris has hit the crossbar when it's 3 1. Um, not enough cutting edge to our play, not enough penetration to our play in the final tour. And in the end, we've thrown all our attacking players on. And um, look, listen, we just got to lick our wounds and move on fast. We're never going to win the FA Cup. It would have been lovely financially to do well in it. Um, and it would have been lovely to have a run in it, but uh, you've got to give Newport credit. They were a better team on the night, and football's about both boxes, so you can have all the possession you want, which is the way I want to play. Um, but if you don't do the business in both boxes, keep it out of your goal, and, uh, and then score in the opposition's end, you lose football matches. Obviously, we would have liked to win today, but do you think that going out of the FA Cup with less games now helps us focus on the league? Not really. We just take one game at a time. We just keep trying to play one game at a time. We've got to dust, dust down now, lick our wounds, and move on to Epsley. Absolutely away on, which is a huge game for us. You know, we want to get back to winning ways, winning the division. It's going to be a tough, tough place to go. So uh, there's no easy games in our division. So we just got to focus on one game at a time, not get too carried away with ourselves. Um, everyone can analyse things and stuff like that, which I do. That's my job. But the main thing for us is just stay focused, stick together, work a little bit harder, and uh, that look will change. Are there any big positives you can take from today? The different phases of the game, the first 25 minutes is just absolute criminal from us. It's football suicide and it's happened to us here, it happened to us in the second half against Oldham. So we, we've got to find a way. We might have to play a little bit more direct and play off Nicky, just be a little bit tighter at the back. It's the winter months now, so we might have to change my philosophy, my philosophy a little bit and just make it winning football. Um, so, look, our end product today obviously wasn't good enough and then on turnover we got murdered. Um, especially, I think their forced attack they scored, didn't they? For count. I actually thought the first goal was a really good goal. I actually went good goal, good move. The second goal was rubbish. It's like dribbling in, in, into the goal like, to Bogle, and he's tapped it in. Then the third goal, like what can you do? You know, it's, it drained the life out of us. But I thought, what I thought we did really well was we come back, we thrown a few punches ourselves, um, and we were just beat with a better team on the day. And then finally, you do mention a change in, or potential change in philosophy there. How big of a difference would you be making, or how much? Sorry, how much bigger a change would you make? You play a little bit more direct. I'd say the possession stats are all in our favour today. I'd say the entry stats are in our favour today into the final toward. and we just be a little bit tighter at the back. And obviously, when you play with possession, you've got to make the pitch big as big as you can. And when you turn the ball over, teams can counter attack on you like they did. So I think the first two goals are counter attacks. The fourth goal is a counter attack, and uh, that's happened to us too many times now. Dean, thanks for your time. Cheers.